Chillin' with a nini. Yay! What you doing? What you eating? What you drinking? Yeah! <laughs> Welcome back, you guys, to my video. Mm, to the video. Mm, to the video. What is it? It's Thursday, y'all. Normally, I'll be saying goodbye for the week after the show, but... As y'all know, I told y'all we doing this thing 28 days this month, every day of this month. So, it's just another day now. <laughs> but how you guys doing, LFAM? What did you do since yesterday? Hmm, tell your girl. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> well, now before we, now LFAM, now you know. Before we get started, your girl gotta say hi to the new um, new people, I know you like, what is going on? What y'all doing today? Today I'm doing an unboxing, but it's going to be something different. I have never done something like this. And as y'all know, it's about to be Valentine's Day. So, it's time to start getting a little ready for the type of Valentine's stuff that I'm going to need. So, it may be stuff that you're looking to try to need. So, that's why your girl doing it. But, uh, like I said, we want to say hi to all the new people. Let them know if you're not subscribed, you want to join the LFM, all you got to do is click that subscribe button. That red one down there. Yes. Because over here we do trial haul, store haul, store reviews. We show things. We we have fun. Um, I was going to say food, but I used to do food. I don't do that no more. But if we do go out to the restaurant, I definitely will show y'all if I go out to eat. But this month, we just definitely just showing, showering love to all my black businesses. What? What? Black businesses? What? What? <laughs> so, but if you like things like that, that's why I said come over and chill with us. Hit that subscribe button. And if you never want to miss an upload a show, because I always do videos Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. Like I said, for this month, we're doing it for the full month. Um, But other than that... Hit the, um, ring that bell so that every time I upload a new show, you'll never miss it. It'll always notify you. So, that's why I said hit the subscribe and hit that bell. Okay? And that's how you join the LFM. It's free to join. Over here we have fun. So, why not? I don't understand why you wouldn't want to join. But other than that, we always cheers it up over here. No matter what you're drinking on. No matter if it's tea, water, lemonade, Kool-Aid, milk, whatever. Mommy juice, wine, uh, mixed drink, shots. Whatever, your preference. No judgment over here. But we always go cheers it up. And your girl always got her red wine something on deck. Now, I'm drinking on my peanut noir again. I didn't want to open a new bottle because I was like, I need to learn to drink all the wines first. So, I'm trying to finish this out. So, but like I said, we always cheers it up. No matter what, I had to put my contacts in, y'all, because we're getting ready to play with stuff on my face. So, um, but before we do that, let's cheers up. But. No, that was wrong. There we go. <laughs> Ring for wine. Why? Because it is time to cling, 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 get up, cling it up, cling it up, Thursday. Cling it up, cling it up, Thursday. Cling it up, cling it up, Thursday. <laughs> yes, if y'all don't know by now, I am very musical. I love music. I cannot sing, but I love music. So, it's all in my bones. It's in my ancestry. My ancestors just have it all through my blood. So, drink it. Yeah. That's good because he'll set and rest it for a good time. So now I had to put this on the video the other day, but let me say this. Drink responsibly with me. Okay. Do not be drinking with me with liquor if you're not over the age of 21. Okay. And do not be drinking and driving. I had to put it on the screen the other day, but I'm going to say it you guys. Don't be doing that. PSA. Don't be doing that. But yes, drink your drink. Mm-hmm. Mm. So like I said, if you like store reviews, store hauls, that's kind of what I'm doing today. I'm doing a store review. I have never tried too many of these things, so that's what I was saying. So if you like that kind of thing, then stay tuned. Stay tuned. What? What? Stay tuned. Okay, y'all. We back. So today, your girl is reviewing a store by the name of Juvia's Place. From what I hear... This is a black owned comp uh, business that is a makeup line and like I said Valentine's Day is coming up and what do ladies need? They need makeup, right? You gotta have some kind of makeup on. Well, you ain't got to because I'm a very naturalist. 
I don't really put on makeup, but I was like, if I'm going to wear any kind of makeup, then I'm definitely, definitely, definitely going to wear a black owned business. So let's get into it. Now, the first ones that I bought, because you can order it off their website, which I did. The only thing about that is it does take a good little minute for it to ship. You sometimes get free shipping, sometimes you don't. But you also can get these items in Ulta. So, see, Ulta. Y'all know that store, that orange store with that you? Yep, that store. So you always get Juvia's Place in Ulta too. So, what I picked up in Juvia's Place recently, or in Ulta recently was, I believe, I don't know what this is. Okay, this is foundation. I'm like, what is this? Why do I not have my glasses? Bye. Yes, I put on contacts. So I have to put on glasses. That's not funny. That's really funny. I don't think. Jesus, oh, in the morning. Do I say what the brand is or what this? Okay, this is a 15 shade, and I think I got another one because I was like, I didn't know. Okay. And this is foundation so this is the concealer so concealer foundation so i have those two so and then i you know i'm a lip, i'm a lip person i love my lipsticks i love my lip stuff so i don't know why i'm holding these boxes like i'm not about to take them out for good just just, just move this all out the way so oh maybe i should have kept that in my hands but that actually tells the color. So I wanted something more like a red lip. So this is called the Cherry Love. So I was like, okay, I know red is going to be red. And then I, uh, the other one I got is called Culture. Now, Culture, 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 it was almost sold out. When me and my mother walked in, it was just the last two left. So that was it. So it must be a very, very popular color, which is like a maroon, um, red, uh, like a maroon burgundish type of color. So that's why your girl had to get that. So do I see it on the bottom? It does not see it on the bottom. Okay, this one says Cherry Love. Why don't this one say? Okay. It just says cultured. So I don't know. That's really weird. So got those. And then I went for a just a lip gloss. Just a clear lip gloss. Can't go wrong with a very glossy lip. And I like the way their brushes was made. I don't know. Can you see that? I don't think you can. But the brush is really, really like it's gonna meet your lips. You're not gonna have to do it one one too many times. So yes. I can take those off now. But that was that. Now, this is what I ordered from Juvia's Place. So let's see what did your girl order. What? So. Did y'all finish telling me what y'all did today? Huh? So what are these? Oh, okay. So I bought more lip glosses. What the what? So I ordered these in the mail. I must you know. I think they be doing a really good sale. So that's probably why. So I bought two of them. It's called a Caramel Rose. So it was like a brownish, reddish color, which I'm into my browns. So y'all can see. Got that color. I don't know. Can you see? I know my lights are kind of bright. You got the Cherry Love. And then we got the Culture, which is like a dark maroonish color. See if I tilt it, y'all can see it. Gotta remember, this is foundation. This is the contour. These are the lip glosses. So, they say their lip glosses is the bomb. I got me some wipes just in case I have to wipe my makeup off. Okay, then they had, I don't know why. I, I go crazy for brushes. I have a ton of brushes. I don't even know why I bought this one, but I was like, you know what? If I'm going to stick to the line of the company, then I might as well just buy their brush too. This is a foundation brush. I'm big on it. It's so cute. I don't want to mess it up. But it's a foundation brush, so you can do it. So, I have not put on makeup in so long, you guys. I don't even know what in the world. I don't even know if I'm going to put on makeup with y'all because I don't want to mess up. Okay, so we're moving on to another shipment. So I did, or okay, so the next three boxes that I'm going to open, definitely I ordered through them. So I try to give them the business because I'm not going to lie. If you go through juviusplace.com, you will get the stuff cheaper. Like the chat, the lips um, liners, they're like $10 in the store. You can get them for $5 on Juvia's Place. So... Only thing is, you got to have patience. Like, straight up. Dang, girl. You got all the colors, didn't you? So, this is a... It's either... 
S15 up. SOS? No. <laughs> I'm guessing it's like a 515. That's the number of it. So, that's weird. It's just called 515. I don't know what I remember I bought. I didn't even know I had this many lip glosses. What's the purpose of this one, Nene? I don't know. I, I, I'm going to have to splash those on my hand. I don't know why I purchased them. Why did I purchase them? <laughs> okay, never mind. This is called, this is a lip gloss called Sis. That's not S O S. That's not 515. It's called Sis. So I like the name of it. So it's like a brownish color. Yeah, it's like a brownish color. So, okay, so this palette here, you guys, is called the Vanessa palette. When I tell you guys this palette is hard to get your hands on it, so if you're able to get your hands on it, get your hands on it. Because it was the one, it's a, um, this was, I think this is just eyeshadows, if I'm not mistaken. I needed to up my, because I had the eyeshadows that I had, I don't need to cut myself. The eyeshadows that I have are very, very old. And I have watched some videos and they're like, no, you're supposed to throw that stuff out. It could possibly break your face out. Why would you want to keep it? And I'm like, I don't know because I'm tripping. And I'm not going to need that because I'm going to be using it. Correct? So, this is an eyeshadow palette. Got to be an eyeshadow palette. Because I don't do cheeks. I only do eyes. And so it was more of a pigment color. I wanted something more at the, like, colors. Because I always put brown on my eyes. And I'm like, girl, you brown. Who going to see the brown over your eyes? Who? Who going to see the brown over your eyes? You tell me, Nene. So, yeah, I was like, uh, let me try something different with some eyeshadows. Then, like I said, testing out this company was like, uh. Let's just see what, you know, might as well buy the whole product line, right? Right? Now, the only thing is, I took a chance on the, I went to buy the um, product as far as, um, okay, so I had bubblegum in my package. So, I probably ought to keep this one just so I didn't know. Um, what was I saying? <laughs> um, with the eyeshadow, it's like, how can you ever see... Um, oh no, I'm sorry. I went into the store for the foundation and the concealer because I wanted to match it to my color as best as I could. And sometimes buying online, I was like, that's the only good thing with Ulta. So go into Ulta, match it up. And then if you want to go and buy it online, then you always could do that. So that's a good thing. Now, these are what I just opened up is baking powders is what they tell me. I've seen a lot of people doing baking powders. I'm not big on baking powders. So if I do feel like maybe I'm a little too bright then i definitely would take the baking powders and mix them now they have three kinds but i actually went with the one that was um calamari no kalahari i got the kalahari i got the go by and then the sahara so i did those three colors let's see can i see it she doesn't show it now baking powders so after i got it I, like i said i think they got five total and I got three out of the five or three out of the six one was more like a yellowish undertone so that would be this one so it gives you that yellowish glowish type of look like I said I'm not big on this I'm not no makeup contour because I'm a very big naturalist so um go be or go by it's more of like a brown color to me I don't know. I know y'all like, girl, you in this makeup. I know. I want to do something different. And I was for the business. Now, ooh, this is bright. Sahari is bright. So I guess if I'm feeling like I'm a little too, um, too, too, too suntan or something, I guess I'll go and find this one definitely and put it on. But I hear with baking powders, you don't always have to um, use them with foundation and concealer. You can just also use them with um, body itself. So, I don't know. See, to each his own, really. Unless you are a real MUA of makeup artist and stuff. So, then you definitely going to know exactly what you're going to use your baking powders with. So, 
But like I said, Valentine's Day is coming up and your girl had to have something, something. Okay, so I was wondering why I had an extra box and that's because they sent your girl an extra eyeshadow. I didn't pay for that. Did I pay for that? No, because... Yeah, they just sent me an extra one. I didn't order this. I don't remember ordering this. But if I did, oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. So I don't know. Maybe blessing that one to somebody. Because I already have one. And I don't wear makeup like that all the time. So, um, one is called Extra. One is called Perfectionist. One is called BSG, the other one's Busy. The middle one at the bottom is called Slush. It better be Slush, not Slush. <laughs> like what? Yeah, Stush. Stush. And then Aqua. Aqua, Aqua, I don't know, whatever. So, um, we're just gonna play with this for a little bit. Just a hot second. Just see what these colors look like. Oh, y'all. But I definitely would do you do a uh, get ready with me video with these. And that'll be easier. Because then we have more time. I know you guys are like, ooh. But I have used the... I know I did the video on my lip liners. So, I love the lip liner. When I say lip liners from um, Juvia's Place is nice, they're nice. So, most definitely... Nah, I already put, look at it, I don't look like I got out. let's see, I guess I could put a little, I ain't bringing out one makeup brush, I can't put on no makeup, I can't bring no extra, I only got a foundation brush, that is so soft and so cute, by Juvie's Place, you know, you gotta keep it up, so, we're just gonna play, now I did bring all my primers and stuff, I got three different primers that I normally use, well I got one that I normally use, two of them is brand new, I don't know what I'm going to do with it. So, um, it's like an oil to get the lip stuff off. So, let's see what this is going to look like. Yeah, I put chapstick on. That helps me get it off. Okay, so we're probably going to want to go with the lighter to darker. So, I'm going to splash it. I'm going to do a swatch on my hand so then we can see what in the because I can't return these I had them too long now mm -mm -mm. so what y'all got planned for the weekend I know it's early I know y'all like Nene it's just Thursday what are you talking about but I'm asking what do you got to do you going to the movies are you going out to eat? Are you preparing for Valentine's Day? Are you guys going anywhere for Valentine's Day? Are you? Do you have Valentine's Day plans? Now I'm going to ask you because I want to know. Okay, so we're going to go with the um, sis first. Sis is first. So let's go with the splash it. And y'all see how big that, let's see. See how big that lip brush is? Yeah. Oh, it smells good. Oh, it smells real good. Oh, it smells, sis, you smell like candy. So we got sis. Mm. Got a little lip clutter there. I can do that one. You know, some light colors look like. You see that splashy right there? Yeah. Some colors look like ashy lips. But that. Oh my goodness. This does smell like candy. Okay. A different one. This one was the 
caramel. That's the one right here. Caramel rose. So it's got like a rosy color to it. Show y'all in a minute. Got that one. So then next will be cherry. Cherry. Y'all, they lip stuff smells so good. Oh my goodness. This is crazy. It smells like candy, y'all. Y'all may want to go to Alta and pick you up some of these. And you may not want to weigh the mail. But then when you find the one that you like, then definitely, definitely go back and... Oh, yeah. Okay. That's cute. So there goes the four spots it's, that I have. Remember, let's see. Let's see if clear smells the same way. Could it possibly smell the same way? I don't see it. It ain't got no bad taste. I ain't taste it, but you know you could get the whiff of it like in your um in your um like through your nostrils and your senses. Your like sense buds could taste it. That's how I'm feeling like. Oh my goodness. Yes, and I'm eager to see if the clear Yes, they got a something is fragrance and this stuff and it smells good. Okay, I'm gonna take this one off so I can try on culture because culture is the one that I really really wanted because I've been looking for a dark color. I don't know why. Everybody's like, you know, you always wearing brown. Have you ever just wear red? Like, and I know the times I put on red. It literally stands out for me. So, we're going to do culture because that's the one I was dying to get. Let's see. We'll put a little lip liner with it too. Okay, y'all. I'm gonna not only did a really thin liner today. Normally I do a thicker. Ain't wasting nothing, baby. Okay. Oh, we y'all. Mm -mm. Not only does it smell good, mm, that's cute. I see that. You see the three colors? So that was sis. That one is caramel. I think I knocked it down. Caramel rose. I don't know why I can't remember caramel rose. So caramel rose. That one is cherry love. And that one is culture. That's the one on my lips. That's cute. That's cute. Mm mm. That's cute. Mm mm. Let's see. Oh, I ain't got no makeup brush. Okay. We just gonna splot the foundation on my cheek. I hope that it works the way I need it to. But yes, the. I use e.l.f. That's what I used to use back in the day is e.l.f. So that's why I went back with e.l.f. Because I know it doesn't break me out. So I'm just going to use that. Oh my goodness. This cherry red.
Mm, I'm sexy. <laughs> I know y'all like, what? What are you doing? Okay, so I put that on. Let's see. I forget I got white pants. Can't be wiping my hands. Nowhere near my pants. Okay, so this is the phone. No, this is the con concealer. So this is what you will use under your eye. And I'm going to do it old school. Like we used to do it with our finger. We had no doggone. Um, we had no doggone brushes back in the day. When I was sneaking and putting on makeup. <laughs> you sneaking and putting on makeup. Mm hmm. And have time to do a so as y'all see, you can use your hands still. Make sure your hands is clean though. Don't be jacking yourself up. Okay. You guys, what? I look a little spooky. The wife said, never do your makeup in front of your husband. <laughs> then you'd be like, what the Oh, and I think I did the baking powder too because the girl on some of the videos that I've seen or that I've watched, they always um highlight their nose and their cheekbones and that's kind of like what I figured baking powder was for. And when I say baking powder, it's not real baking powder. It's like baking your face that make it beat a little bit more. So that's why I did see what a lot of people was using, especially the yellowish one, which is called Kalahari. Kalahari was for that highlighter that you'll be looking for. So. And I hate I didn't bring my brush or my makeup so I could at least try to do. I could use my finger. I'll just clean it off. No, <laughs> spooky. <laughs> but as it sits, you know. If you're first time with makeup, trust me. You have to have patience. Like, straight up. Do not do your makeup an hour before you got to leave, okay? Make sure you do your makeup out, like, at least two, three hours before you have to get ready to go. At least your foundation and your concealer and all that. Because, Jesus, it has to sit for a while. And that's why I was like, I'm not going to do a whole bait See, Yeah. So, makeup enhances my look like i know i'm a you know i'm a pretty girl <laughs> but makeup just enhances things and i know when i used to be in high school they used to be like you don't need makeup lanini you don't need makeup but now as i see i've gotten older i'm like oh wait hold on my freckles came out that's on my daddy's side so yeah thanks daddy <laughs> like thanks daddy okay it's like a makeup remover or something that I got over there. So, that is the foundation. That is cute. Or the, that's a concealer. This would be the foundation, which would be more of a harder press. But I did that because I wanted to try out one of the eyeshadow palettes. So, let's see. Should we do extra? Or should we do busy? I think I'm going to do... Mm, I'm more of a perfectionist though too. Watch me not know how to open it. I'm like, well, guys. Oh, okay. It's just a piece of paper. <laughs> okay, let's see. I'm probably gonna want. Okay, foundations now. Bottles are very small, so that's why I said I'm glad I'm not a big makeup person because I probably will lose it. Like, it's all the makeup I get. Oh my god. So the concealer set really good. Oh my god. Jeez. The foundation is. So I definitely would have to prime my face more and more and more. Let's see. I pray I got the right color. Because you know when you first put it on. That's why I've noticed. When you first put on makeup. You are bright as all get out. And then you're like what the heck did I just do to myself? 
But I know when I have normally put on my eyeshadow, it's not, it don't come through because I don't have, um, the right, um, I don't have no makeup on my eyes. So, that's why it don't always come through correctly. And this stuff that I got, you guys, that I'm wiping off everything, um, I got it from... Um, I want to say Macy's. It came with a package that I bought one time before. But I do have Neutrogena makeup wipes over here so I can clean off my fingers a little bit better. Yeah, because I got white pants. Like I said, I don't need to mess my pants up. Okay, so I'm going to do this eyeshadow real fast. Because it's not, like I said, it wasn't nothing to really... But y'all can see the difference. Why do I look like that thing with the mask? It has a white and black face. <laughs> or it has a white face and it'd be broken. And you see the man on one side of the face. What is that? Opera monster or something? Opera man? I don't know. I just know he. some of the movies he'd be a killer in it. So, <laughs> so I'm going to do perfectionist because of the simple fact. Um, I don't know. I'm a perfectionist. So, Perfectionist is like a purplish color. I don't know. Y'all, like I said, I'm doing this with my finger. So, it's going to be like something if I wanted a highlighter. Like, I'm really trying to be seen today. <laughs> oh, my God. I'm really trying to be seen if I do this color. So, like I said, I wanted to step out the box. I don't have my eye makeup or my eye brush, though. So. I just want to do something a little different. It just played with it, y'all. It wasn't to do a whole beat face. Like I said, I'll have to do a get ready with me one day. To where I have to do a speed up. That won't do no talking. I'll just be doing the makeup. And see how it turns out with a brush. You know? Like, Lenini, you need a brush. You need a brush, girl. Oh, I got the dog thing in my hand. Okay, so. Yeah, see? Okay, so. Uh, I let it sit for a little bit, but like I said, it's not a full beat face. But one thing I could tell you the coverage is the bomb. Why? Because it definitely covered up my freckles. My little freckles that I inherited over the years. It did a dang good cover up. So I cannot wait till I use the brush to do the full foundation. And then I also have a concealer. Um, I have my um, my pad that I can more um, blend. My blending brush. I can do more blending for the concealer. And then for the foundation, I could do more of the foundation um, with that. So... I kind of, you know, I really can say I can stand behind Julia's place. Because y'all see the difference. Like, I still cute, girl. <laughs> but right now, look at the ring on it. But it did a coverage. So, I, I, I have no complaints. So, if you guys was wondering, was it a good product to use? I definitely stand behind it. The lip gloss, y'all. It smells so good still on my lips. I smell the smell from my lips up to my nose. So, it smells like candy. It's soft. The lip brush is so big to you not having to go over your lips over and over and over again. It's big enough to fit your lips. It slides on really good. It smells good. It feels... I say stand behind them, y'all. I... This was like... This was an open box I have never tried. The only thing, like I said, I'll try from Juvia's Place is the lip liner. That was my go-to for them. But I have to try everything else. So me kind of putting it on here with you guys. Once again, y'all see the colors. So I see how I match up really well. So if you are a light girl, these colors will work. If you dark girl, listen, Juvia's Place got it for every skin tone, okay? It's black on. So try them out. They local. You can go there and see what they work with you. So, um, but your girl is done for today. I hope you guys have fun. I will catch you guys tomorrow because it will be Friday. And y'all have to just come back and see what your girl got up her sleeve for tomorrow. Let's see what your girl got up for tomorrow. <laughs>
<laughs> but I love you guys. I'll catch you guys tomorrow. Have a good day. Have a good night. Whenever you watch this. And be safe. Don't get in no trouble. So that you can come back and chill out with your girl. And I'll catch y'all tomorrow. Bye, y'all. <laughs>